Russia lost its last cruise missile carrier in Crimea, ATA CMS missiles played a decisive role. The head of the Joint Coordination Press Center of the Defense Forces of Southern Ukraine, Dmitry Pletenchuk, notes that there is a possibility that the Russian occupiers have lost their last cruise missile carrier in Crimea. He said this on air at the telethon, answering the question about what the Russian Black Sea fleet lost in the port of Sevastopol, what was hit there. Perhaps all the personnel were amazed. They are very amazed. Now, we are verifying the rest of the information as of now. But of course, there is a possibility that the Black Sea fleet in Crimea lost the last carrier of cruise missiles, Pletenchuk noted. Earlier, the Russian telegram channel Spy Dossier wrote that during an attack on Russian-occupied Sevastopol, the Russian small missile ship Cyclone could have been sunk. According to the Telegram channel on the night of May the 19th, the Project 22800 ship Karakurt was in the port. The Ukrainian army hit it with two ATA CMS ballistic missiles. As a result of the strike, six servicemen of the Russian Black Sea Fleet were killed and another 11 people were injured. The ship itself sank. On May the 19th, the Ukrainian armed forces sank another warship of the Russian Black Sea Fleet, the minesweeper Kovrovets. In just 27 months of full-scale war, Ukraine destroyed or damaged more than a dozen pre-war Russian ships. According to Forbes, the Kovrovets was sunk using a pair of American ATA CMS missiles. This munition is designed for land attacks and its use as an anti-ship weapon is quite unusual. This is due to the fact that the accuracy of the ATA CMS with inertial guidance, according to some sources, is about 9 meters from the target. When it comes to a ship, this is not enough. At the same time, the ATA CMS M39 at 160 kilometers and M39A1 at 300 kilometers scatter hundreds of grenade-sized submissions, which makes up for the lack of accuracy. They are capable of damaging the top of the ship, but are unlikely to sink the ship since this requires breaking through the hull. However, if ATA CMS was used to sink Kovrovets, this could mean that there is a 270 kilometer version of the M48 or M57 ATA CMS 300 missile with 200 kilogram warheads in addition to the M39 and M39A1 ATA CMS with submissions. This suggests that M48 and M57 are more accurate than many observers assumed and the implications are significant. The Black Sea Fleet vessels that remained in Sevastopol are within range of the M39A1, M48 and M57. If ATA CMS is destroying Russian warships in Sevastopol, it's hard to imagine the base being of much use to the Russians, added Phillips O'Brien, professor of strategic studies at the University of St. Andrews. At the same time, the S-400s, which were hunted by the Ukrainian armed forces in Crimea, were unable to intercept ATA CMS. According to military consultant Nuno Felix, the Russians do not have the capabilities to counter these missiles. Водки могут быть. Аккуратно. Да, они взведенные все. Машина взорвалась, пацаны там. Идем через минное поле. Помогать пацанам. Thank you. 
Thank you.